thank you all the faculties of speed and all the members if you want guidance for that speed is the only institute that actually provide guidance for head neck surgery no other institute has it so just enroll with it so i bring in all the wishes and greetings and behalf of all the faculty members and team of speed medical institute to dr sri jana saha for yes. taking rank number topmost rank of rank number 6 in mca head and neck group for mca head and neck oncology in neat ss session 2024 congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir thank you all the faculties of speed and all the members great doctor and uh, can we know a brief history from where you started your career until date what all you have accomplished can you share something on that sure sir sir i did my mbbs from kolkata nrs medical college and then i joined ms ent in ipgmr kolkata ssk m hospital then i did one year of senior residency as a born service in west bengal as well in same institute which now has four seats of nc uh, head neck now then i break of two months or three months for the preparation and then i wrote the exam great doctor very good actually I mean you have done phenomenally well and can you tell us why the interest of doing in a, a super speciality in mca head neck onco when it started how it started can you tell us something on that sir it actually started from internship basically i really wanted to go into a surgical branch i always loved it then when i got my rank in neat pg i started acquiring the knowledges of how the other subjects are like in general surgery ent as my rank permitted i thought that ent would be better in a good college since then i have uh, researched about it head neck surgery and everything what all i can do after ent then i thought that this is head neck surgery would be the best for me then i joined pg and then actually very luckily my hospital there in kolkata it has a separate unit head neck so we used to go for rotation for one and half months for every year so it actually improved my knowledge and everything inspired me to be the head neck surgeon and then i thought this is the only path and i'll just go for it very very nice doctor and mm -hmm. can you tell us the preparation strategy what you did after you decided to go for mc jadena oncology what are the preparation strategy what is the time that you allocated how you achieved this rank sir actually i i was very keen on reading head neck part only so i used to read more of head neck than ent during the residency itself but after that i joined speed just after, during my senior residency during the one year i started a little bit late i think in november or december last year i read all the scott brown chapters i actually read scott brown thoroughly and also i followed all the videos of teja sir the videos are really great i really want to thank teja sir because it he guided me so well and then i took the mock tests and all the grand tests i could not do the all grand test few of them but other mcqs i did and few other books as well but speed mostly speed and scott brown mostly okay how many questions did you attend in this exam doctor i think sir as far as i remember i attempted 142 or 143 questions okay what will be your advice for the future aspirants of head neck oncology mch sir first i think it is a very taxing branch because i have already worked for it for one year as senior resident so first i would like to tell other juniors and any other people who are aspiring for it that you need to have the passion you have to have the passion for mch head neck surgery and the subject itself and love for it and then they have to go for it and then more for the preparation i would say start early read scott brown or any other textbook scott brown is the best we know and for the other guidance part because we know textbooks have everything but if you want guidance for that speed is the only institute that actually provide guidance for head neck surgery no other institute has it so just enroll with it and do the mcqs again and again mcqs are the only thing that helps us because uh, the exam is mcq so that's all correct now can you i mean is a time for you i mean to use this platform to thank 
who all have helped you, have stood by you from day one till date to what you have achieved? That will be a great opportunity, sir. First, I'll obviously like to thank my parents. Without them, I could not have done this. The sacrifices they made, my in-laws, and actually want to thank my husband. He is also a neurosurgeon. Oh. So he guided me through the general surgery part, actually. So okay. always in general surgery part. And all my teachers in my hospital, Dr. Sengupta, sir, he is the director of our institute. And he brought four seats of MCH in our institute. So all of them. I would like to thank everyone. And lastly, obviously, Speed. Thank you so much. Great, great doctor. Thank and, you. Uh, yeah. I mean, I acknowledge and also convey my wishes to all your family members. And yeah. also Teja, sir, he's the best. <laughs> yes, I will convey that to him. We also convey from our part to all your family members who have helped you and Thank stood you, by you sir. to achieve what Thank you're doing. You. Once again, wish you all the best and all the success for a great career ahead in MCH at a Thank, Thank you, doctor. Thank you so much.